I have no doubt if they were pointed the right direction, they could see Guguji. And uh, maybe they would see you waving from Guguji. <laughs> of course, in our uh, worm-like state, we have no hands. We only have uh, uh, antennas in front of our faces. So we couldn't uh, wave in the traditional sense. But you understand what I mean, Gugujians. When I left my new friend Armando in Albuquerque, New Mexico, it was time to head further west toward Arizona. So I had made the plan to drive south from Albuquerque and end up in Lordsburg in a cheap hotel for one night near the border of Arizona. But on my way, I was so tempted to go see the very large array, which is about 50 miles off the main highway at the town of Socorro. However, the very large array is currently closed to the public, so it would have been a trip just to see the very large array from the road. I'm very bummed out because one of the things that I really wanted to see on this trip was the very large array, but it is closed because of COVID. However, you can see the... It is closed, but you can still see it from the road. I don't think you can get an idea of just how impressive this array is, but let's see if we can try. There it is. I think there are over 20 uh, of these dishes. It's a telescope and they work together to create an even more powerful telescope. Anyway, from this sort of device uh, or series of devices, one could see Guguji. And I'm sure they have seen Guguji, although perhaps they didn't recognize that uh, there is thriving life on Kukuchi? Well, I don't know that we can get much closer than this, but uh, we will try to turn up the dirt road here and see if there are any signs prohibiting us from getting a little bit closer. But we don't want to do anything that we're not supposed to do. We would just like to, to look at it from the road and maybe come back another time when it is open. I believe there are 27 dishes together and they make up a very large array which which uh, work together to make one massive telescope that can, unlike uh, most of the telescopes that look to the heavens, uh, they can see during the day. Unlike conventional telescopes, which see visible light or optical light, the light seen by the human eye, the very large array or VLA can see radio waves. And when they link the 28 radio telescopes together, astronomers can see a very large and distant swath of space indeed. Each of these massive dishes has a diameter of 82 feet and weighs 209 metric tons. At the tippy top of the antenna, it is a towering 94 feet high. These magnificent telescopes can be moved by a series of tracks, like railroad tracks, into several different configurations to change the view into the vast firmament. They can spread across the desert in a Y pattern, which can be as large as 13 miles apart. What a fantastic human achievement! Even though I just saw the very large array from the road, it was still magnificent to see. True, the technology existing on Guguji is far more advanced, but it's exciting to see what humans are doing and how they are progressing. Well, that is the very large array, Guguji's. Hopefully the next time we pass through, things will be back to normal. So signing out, I say, 
Google G's Jakarta Prij.